It's a beautiful day in Frisco and Colleyville, Texas. So thanks for, again, thanks for being here. We are made for you, Lord, and our hearts are restless until we rest in you. Today's all about encountering Jesus with the Eucharistic revival that our church has going on today. So let Jesus happen in your life today. Uh, so with that, I'm going to go ahead and start uh, with our our gracious host, uh, Father Rudy from St. Francis. He's going to come up and give us an opening prayer and a welcome. Uh, again, thank you, man, for being here uh, today. Appreciate it. Good morning, brothers. Good morning. Such a blessing to stand here and welcome you to our parish of St. Francis. You come from near and far to be strengthened by the Lord, to have fellowship with one another, to be inspired by the riches of our faith, and it is just such a joy to welcome all of you. I think close to or even over 600 of you from, from near and far. What, what, a, what a blessing. So welcome in a special way our superb, excellent speakers. Wow, Father Donald Conaway, Dr. David Enders, Matthew Leonard, uh, some of the brightest minds in the, in the church today. What a blessing to have them here. Of course, always a pleasure to welcome Dave Moore and his music team that inspire us and lift our minds and hearts up to God with, with music and, and prayer. And I thank the planners of this event. You can tell that a lot of love and dedication went into planning this event. Everyone who is here today has really done a tremendous job, really allowed themselves to be instruments in the hands of God and did their work, um, and, I, and I know you will see it in the presentations and the music and, and everything, the, everything is done with a, a servant's heart. What a unique conference that men gather together to deepen their faith because they take seriously the vocation they have received in Christ. They want to be the best fathers and husbands and, and men of the church. And so I'm so happy to see many of you leaving behind your, your very busy schedules and, and come and encounter the Lord and encounter each other and build yourselves up in faith. May you give God glory in, in everything that you do. And so officially, I, I welcome you. I know that God will be at work uh, amongst you and that you will see his hand. So feel welcome. Have a great conference. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we praise you for this conference and for your purpose in it. We know, Lord, that when we gather together, you are present in our midst and that you always have a divine agenda. <clears throat> and we love you for that. That even when we have done what you have asked, the results are so much greater than we could ever have imagined. Even in failed attempts, you blow us away with your faithfulness to provide what we need. Our prayer today is that, <clears throat> is that your will be done. Take what we have prepared, multiply our efforts as only you can, steer our intentions to align with your holy will. Remind us, Lord, that you provide, and when our efforts fail us or fall short, you come through in ways that we can hardly imagine. May all glory go up to you. And when we reach the finish line and climb over benchmarks, may we give you glory. Blanket us with your, with your power, with your peace today. Keep us safe. Guard our hearts and minds from pride and selfishness. Keep love at the forefront of our minds today as you are love. And help us to accomplish and celebrate in growing deeper in our faith. This we pray through Christ our Lord. Amen. I will now bless the bracelets that will be given to you. These bracelets that have on them, um, we were made for you, O Lord. Heavenly Father, we ask your blessing upon these bracelets that remind us that you have created us for yourself, that we belong to you with all of our being, that you created each one of us uniquely for your great purposes, that you have great plans for us. And we ask you that you would always cover us with your strength and your love and your mercy. And we ask your blessing upon these bracelets, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen.
Thank you, men. Again, have a great conference. God bless you. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.